today i'm going to talk about my medical degree experience and just what i feel after i got my mba my aggregate score is 63% i was never like smartest kid in the class but i was never one who was failing in this subject and that subject and i think it's fine if you fail in some subject i really believe that is okay that time it was scary stuff that you are failing because you get to go to another batch or effort batch that was traumatic to even think about um so in first year after first year i figured it out how what kind of study this degree demand i could have some people who could suggested me but i was not aware that there will be people who will you know tell me or maybe i was not in a zone of listening to anybody i was doing my thing so i was confident that i'm going to pass my exam i did so many crazy stuff during my exam like on the day of exam final year final year of bbs exam when everybody is studying in my hostel i used to go on walk so i used to go in gardens and stuff it's like yeah i did crazy stuff which was kind of kind of unusual uh, amongst the student i had along with me but i knew i figured it out what it is expecting from me and i thought after mbbs i'll be happy cuz now after getting your degree people look at you in a different way they think that oh you can figure it out this easy or you can help me but that's not true but i think my experience and my confidence would have been a little bit better if i was not hoping that it, this institution will teach me how to take care of people rather than me going after oh in this situation what should i do what's my best way and whom should i ask i don't have to know everything but at least i should know that okay this is the basic protocol i can follow these are the basic things and it's not that institution want me to learn it it, it would have been better if i wanted to learn it you know after i did my internship in gmc nagpur government medical college nagpur and a government hospital internship is little different than a private hospital you are just pushed in pushed into some situation you don't have a clue what to expect and what to do you just go through roll through the process but through rolling through the process you and us get calm you you get the confidence that you can go through anything but that's another confidence that you go through anything during the emergency and kind of confident that i can handle emergency but what's the best practice for me i am not confident on that and i felt kind of detachment after my mbbs degree that how good am i with my degree i had that question i still do i still do i don't know about other people but i think that question is okay okay to ask but now in the retrospect when i think i think degree a degree certificate cannot give you that confidence you know that the inner confidence it will just give you a certificate it like somebody else is telling you oh you are good enough but that will never satisfy our desire to really do our job in a good manner so that was my it would have been my responsibility to go behind and understand stuff it would have taken more time and that's fine you know rather than going fast and knowing nothing it's okay if i do it slow and go after what i think i could do better because even if i spend that many years into that degree if i am still feeling unsatisfied then it was not worth it so my, my, i'm thinking now that i'm in phd position in phd program i am thinking in terms of rather than somebody if somebody gives me a phd degree that that won't give me that confidence that oh i know certain thing thing oh i know how how to do this kind of research no i have to go behind it learn it and go forward from it rather than waiting for a degree certificate now it is totally a uh, different jam for me and if if it takes long time i think I, i'll be i'll i'll make peace with that but at least i'll be confident that okay when i'm say i know this thing i at least know that particular thing and i could do my job better so that that's just a, a thought simple thought that a 
piece of paper might satisfy the people but what does satisfy you is your own evaluation of your skills and i think that's the most important because you forget that you have daily you stay with this person for long you you stay with this person when you face patient when you face people who ask you some question so i think this is something we have to be aware of going behind degree 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 education education so no let's 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 look at it in a different way and give each other a little bit of space to know what we wanted to know and what we wanted to do better